One of the worst feelings in pickleball is when you get stuck in your game. For some reason, you're not hitting shots the way you once did, or maybe you're not competing at the same level with the same people. Today, we're going to cover one of the most important skills that can help with this. It's rarely talked about, but if you use it, not only can you get unstuck, but you can compete at a higher level. Let's get into it. Welcome to High Five Pickleball, where we help you play better, win more, and make the most of your time on the court. My name is Adam Richards, and today we're covering the skill of self-awareness. Learning certain shots and techniques is a great thing, but the first step to unlocking true growth and improvement in pickleball is your awareness of what you need to improve. For example, currently you're playing at a certain level and you're aspiring to get better. In order to get from point A to point B, there are skills to learn and things to unlearn that will help you close the gap. It may sound simple, but self-awareness of this skills gap and the steps to take can help in a huge way. Self-awareness is an extensive topic, so to keep it brief and to make it immediately useful, we'll look at how to uncover blind spots. Blind spots are those things that other people know about you that you don't know about yourself. The faster you can uncover blind spots in your game, the faster you can make a plan and improve. If you'd like to learn more about this model or the other areas, I'll leave a link to it in the description. So, how can you gain more awareness and uncover blind spots in your game when games move fast and you don't have a ton of time to stop, think, and adjust? That's what we're answering in this video, and it's coming right up. But before we do that, I want to give you a free gift. It's called The Path to Better Pickleball. This is a 30-day jumpstart guide for anyone who wants to improve at pickleball. After signing up, you get a downloadable skills guide and 10 videos sent straight to your inbox. Over the course of 30 days, you'll cover 10 important skills that every player needs to know. Over a thousand players have joined, and if you'd like to join for free, just click the link in the description. All right, let's get into it. One of the fastest ways to get feedback on your game and to grow your awareness is to record yourself playing. It may feel awkward at first, but you will be surprised at how much you learn just in a few seconds of watching. If you have a smartphone, just use that. Record yourself in a game or two, and you'll want to look for themes throughout, like unforced errors, or maybe your mechanics. If you'd like one of these phone tripods, I'll include a link to them in the description. Another way to get feedback is to ask a trusted friend to watch you play or to share what they see after you play a game. Give them a heads up before playing so they know to be watching. If you're not exactly sure what to ask, my suggestion would be to ask two questions. What are you doing well? And what is an area you can improve? One of the best ways to get more awareness on your game is to talk to a certified instructor. A good instructor can watch you play, give you detailed feedback on what they're seeing, and they can even give you a plan on how to improve. Lastly, a great way to improve your awareness is to go up against better players. Better players can be like spotlights for your game. They can quickly find your weak spots that maybe you don't know about, and they can shine a light on them. Now that you've gotten some feedback, it's important to remember to put it into practice. This extra attention to your game can make the difference between good and great playing. What do you think of this type of mindset content? If you'd like to see more, please let me know in the comments. And if there are other things to explore, let me know that as well. And as always, if you enjoyed this video or learned something new, please remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss another update from High Five Pickleball. Thanks for watching.